Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Tonight I'm doing a garden test on the DD Jura 2 sleeping bag. Now it says minus five degrees and you can get probably a little bit more warmth when you use the hammock quilt and the under blanket. So I'm gonna get off because the noise around here is horrendous from in the garden. The reason why I'm testing in the garden is I'm not 100% sure it can go to minus five so it is minus three tonight but it's going to feel like minus seven with the wind chill so i've set my armor cup if all goes wrong i can't get warm i've at least got my house i can go in get a bigger sleeping bag what i've got or i can just stay in my home and keep warm this is a lot better than going to the woods because if i go to the woods i get cold then it means me packing up at two three o'clock in the morning when it's at its coldest going home walking through the woods coming home and trying to warm up this way so this way is better, I can set up in the garden, if it don't work, I'm not warm enough, then I can just go indoors. So it is really a review video of the Jura 2 sleeping bag. I've got the extra large, there's the foot box at the bottom where I read quite a lot of comments about condensation build up, you wake up with wet feet in the morning, people saying they get cold feet through it, and there's a few other people who do say at the end of it, no problems, perfect all round. So when it gets darker, I will be in this and I will get back to it. Right, so I'm in my sleeping bag. The minute I got in the sleeping bag, I started to warm up lovely. And I've just got my quilt, DD quilt, just to keep warm there, that bit of extra. Uh, under blankets on. To say it's minus three outside, but with the wind chill, it's minus seven. I don't know how that works out, but that's what they're saying. But it feels like minus seven to say. Uh, my body's pretty warm for now, so if I have any problems through tonight, I'll get back to you. It's very easy to get in this sleeping bag now, the DD hammock one. It's very easy to get in. I'm not shuffling around, I've got no problems getting in there. Uh, so far, my body's nice warm, my feet are warm. So that's the main thing, the foot box causes condensation apparently, or you can get cold feet in it. Some people say they're pretty warm. At the moment, mine are warm, so thumbs up there. So any problems through night, I'll get back to you. And if I don't get back to you at night, I'll see you in the morning. So good night, and thank you for watching. And if you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button now while I go to sleep. And I'll see you when I wake up. Well, good morning, everyone. Uh, good night's sleep in this jar of sleeping bag. The foot box, no condensation build up. I didn't have cold feet. Very now, I'm just warm. I'm, I'm, I'm just going to put it straight down. I'm, I'm nice and warm. I've been warm all night. Say it was minus two, wind chill of seven. And it's still cold now. My hands are freezing. But yeah, I'm uh, I'm really happy with this sleeping bag. I'm looking forward to using it a lot, lot, lot more. Very easy to get into that centre zip. Big strong zip. And you get like some uh, decent sized pockets as well. Amazing. Yeah, I really like it. I'm glad my missus got a bit for Christmas, thank you very much. Right, I just want to say congratulations to a, uh, I think it's Scottish Wanderer. If not, I'll put his name up here on the channel. I'm sure it's Scottish Wanderer, he's just hit 3,000 subscribers. He's got a really good channel, go pop over and have a look at it. He's a really good channel. Uh, yeah, 3,000 subscribers. He's been getting about 30 a day, I think he is. Well, to my next video, I'm going to pitch my pyramid tent up in garden, and I'll try that with the sleeping bag on the floor. Garden testing's better than you know when you do go out and out and about somewhere. You know you're not going to have problems with it. So yeah, that's my next video coming up probably. So until then, uh, goodbye and thank you for watching. And please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you're not already subscribed.